Hi, my name is Dante, and I'll be showing you my Xbox 360. As you can see, we have all the major stuff. Like, we have the disc carrier thing. We have memory card places. We even have the power button. Yes. So, we'll look, take a look around. Here's the hard drive. This took me a pretty long time to make. Not too long. The only thing is, is I didn't get my, I didn't get the back of it done. So let's check this out. Some tools that I used were the pan tool, like this. You can move it around. We used also the orbit tool. Uh, I used multiple tools like the line tool, which you can make simple lines, like that. You can also use the command Z to erase it, or you can go file, or edit, and then you can do redo, and undo. I used the resize tool, because at first this was pretty big, and yeah, I I did also use the color tool, which you can choose like different colors, like metal, which is like this, you like that. You can change stuff by like maybe going like that. <laughs> that looks like a weird Xbox, doesn't it? All right. Well, uh, some challenges I faced were creating the right size and everything, especially this, the hard drive. We have the bottom and everything. I really do not know what that is, but it's I think it's like a memory card holder or something like that. I don't know. Uh, but let's go over. I had to use the arch tool for the circle. You can make little circles. Uh, as, as you can see, I used the Fancy. Uh, it was a really hard thing to make because you couldn't find any tutorials on how to make it. But uh, <clears throat> I just had to go off it with my head or look at a picture and do it. Um, some things that were hard were like the curves on the Xbox, <clears throat> and we also had to use the the compass tool so I could s spin stuff around and use little guidelines. We had to use the uh, the push pull tool to pu take stuff out, put it back. We had to uh, use the paint bucket tool and all that. <coughs> Well, you also can use the zoom in. We had to use lots of guidelines for the beginning of it. Because at the beginning it was just a little box that so we had to use a bunch of the little guidelines like... Well, I'll show you them real fast. See, as you can see, there's the lines that we had to do. Alrighty then. With this, you can like change colors, like if you want to get like a special mix of like green and yellow, maybe like that, like that. Change it to get it dark. Yeah. All right. Well, some tools I thought that were helpful was was the uh, erase key because like if you mess something up like that if you messed it up you could have just gone like that like that you know yeah and some challenges I faced some of them were like drawing the getting the right size for the circles and everything Especially the curves, and I already said that. But yeah, that 
was my experience experience with Google SketchUp making my Xbox 360 elite.